going on guys welcome to Katernik's Corner my name's Terry and today I'm out back uh, moving around a little bit of compost I cleaned up the uh, the compost pile that we've been uh, using for the past uh, I don't know six months or so and I moved it up here on the slab let it dry out a little bit and now I'm taking it around and uh, placing it in the gardens but I thought this would be a good time to to uh, bring you guys out here and show you uh, what the compost uh, material looks like once it's been composted and the benefits of composting your uh, quail's manu uh, manure. Okay, so let me bring you in a little bit closer and you can see the uh, texture and composition of the uh, compost. As you can see, the uh, quail manure has all been incorporated into the pile by the uh, black soldier fly larva and the wood chips from the uh, clean out trays has pretty much all rotted and composted into uh, a decent compost material and over here that's the beginning of the new uh, compost pile uh, we'll probably run that for about six months and uh, we'll end up with another pile like this um, I'm probably gonna end up having to give a lot of this stuff away just because I don't have a whole lot of room to either store it or the garden space to spread it out in but that's fine the neighbors I'm sure will appreciate it okay so I'm gonna wheel some of this compost around to the front of the house uh, I've got a couple planters out there that I want to add it to uh, before my wife plants her flowers out there and uh, I'll show you what we've got going on out there okay so here's the planter that I'm adding the compost to uh, basically I just dump it in there and spread it out Okay, and then what I'll do is I'll take a shovel and kind of turn it into the soil a little bit. So if you're wondering what to do with all the uh, excess manure that your quail are producing, why not start you a little compost pile out back? And in a couple months you'll have a pile like this, some usable compost that you can spread in your uh, vegetable gardens or on your flower beds, or you can even share it with your family and friends if they could use it. Um, I know this was a short video today guys, but I just wanted to show you the results of my efforts in composting and what I do with the compost. So I want to thank you for stopping by today guys. Uh, if you're not already subscribed, please do so. It helps me out and you'll get notifications of any new and upcoming videos. And uh, like I say, thanks a lot and we'll see you on the next one. I've got to get back to work.